Jonah, what's going on? 1247, the great one. Like I always say, it's a great day to be great. Haven't said that in a minute. Last couple of videos. It's a great day to be great. Um, Jonah, I gotta ask a question, man. I gotta ask a question. Here, here's this, this. I'm doing some math. Let's do some math. Let's do some math. Just showed you guys a clip on OWN Network saying that back in 2017, that so-called American black man was getting with ABW at 85% clip. But here's, here's, here's the issue. If we're getting with the ABW at 85%, and last time I checked, I believe blackeconomics.com, I believe women issue divorce at 70%? So gentlemen, what is the success rate of a marriage? If you're getting with somebody at 80%, but they're divorcing you at seven, over 70%. So gentlemen, do you really, honestly, can we, can we really say that there's a community, if there's only a 15% chance of success in marriage in the so-called black community? You get with them at 85, but they're divorcing you at 70. But then we're supposed to go in this stupid circle. So we get with them at 85%, right? According to the 2017, I believe, census or something like that. And Black Economics has these women filing for divorce at 70%. So 85 minus 70 is 15. Gentlemen, there is no black community. I said all that to say there is no black community. If your uh basically your 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 successful marriage rate is at 15%. You don't have a community. That's that gentleman you're sticking around. So basically you have a 70% chance of this woman divorcing you. So out of 10 marriages, seven of those females are asking for divorce. Gentlemen, that is trash. That is trash. Rags. And these women want you to stick around to do what? To clean up. They get ran through and you're supposed to stick around and clean up their boo-boo. You are sticking around the so-called black community to clean up boo-boo. Gentlemen, Ain't no such thing as no black love. Black love is a fallacy. It's false. It's not real. You're just a cleanup guy. You're getting with them at 85%. And this is this is five years ago. So it might be it. I don't know what the number is now, but I'm just gonna take the 85 from 2017. And I believe black economics has women asking for divorce at 70%. Gentlemen, that's 15%. Gentlemen, that's so low. I don't that's that's not even point. That's no that's not even worth talking about. That's how low it is. That's that's beyond sad. Like gentlemen, that is beyond sad. And you're supposed to stick around to do what again? We already said it at in the, in the so-called community, the single motherhood rate is over 70%. So it seems like to me that these women that, that once again, that says that you so-called black men just don't like black women. It seems to me that these women want to be by themselves and have babies. That's what the numbers say. 
this is I'm not making this up. You guys go look at blackeconomics.com, the CDC. So it seems like to me that these women want to be single, have a whole bunch of sex, have babies, but don't want to be with you. But somehow you're supposed to stick around and we're you're going to rebuild some type of utopia? Gentlemen, smoking mirrors. Smoking me. You're going to rebuild a utopia where this female is going to guarantee ask for a divorce. 70%. 70% of women are asking for divorce. Seven out of ten marriages. These females are asking for divorce. And you gentlemen are going to find some Cinderella in the community? No. You're going to look for, you're going to find some type of Cinderella in this modern day community. Nah, gentlemen, you're not going to find that. Either. You can have fun. I, I, I don't want to use the words of Mr. R uh, Ramel Lemire, but uh, Mr. Uh, I, 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 I hate to say pump and dump, but man, pump and dump is, that's, that's what the uh, scene that's what it seems like what's happening in the, in the so-called American black community there's a whole bunch of pumping and dumping no building just pumping and dumping but if you don't participate in the pump and dump there's a problem there's, a, there's something wrong with you it seems like these women don't want to be pumped and dumped get, 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 up, get all types of skeeted in then have babies that complain that there's no there's no uh -uh, there's no good man around. See, gentlemen, what gentlemen, what kind of what kind of world are we living in in this in the community, gentlemen? Pump and dump is the way of life in the community. Women have already told you that they're not submitting, they're not doing nothing. So, gentlemen, what are you waiting around for? Once again, 85% of the time, you gentlemen are you gentlemen are seeking so-called American black women. 85% we are seeking them. 85% of the time, you so-called African American men are seeking out the so-called ABW. 85% of the time. Gentlemen, if that's not race loyal, I don't know what to tell you. We are seeking them out 85% of the time, which leaves 15% to everybody else. But 70% of the time, they're asking for divorce. So we seek them out. So it seems like to me, we like them more than they like us. Uh-oh. But somehow, it seems like the African American man doesn't like the black woman. No, it seems like the so-called ABW don't like us. Because at 85% of the time we are looking for you, but 70% 70, 70 of the time that you're divorcing us, it doesn't seem like the so-called ABW likes us. She wants to use you, but she don't like you. That's what it seems like. She wants to use you, but she don't really like you. But somehow you gentlemen are supposed to stick around and rebuild some utopia, X, Y, and Z, yada, 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 yaggy, smackity, smoke and mirrors, a bunch of magic. There is no such thing as black love. It's my honest opinion. There is no such thing as black love. It's black pumping and dumping. It's black toleration, but there is no black love. And love is, is one-sided because it's, it's, it, it seems like the men are doing the more seeking than the women. We seek them out damn near 90%, but they leave us at 70. So gentlemen, that success rate of you being with this woman successfully is, I don't, I don't say at 15%. Y'all, 15% is nothing. 
you can't give somebody 15% of nothing, gentlemen. That's that's trash. That's beyond trash. That's not even that's not even a point to even get mad at a so-called uh, a black American man if you see him with Maria. Hey, 70, listen, 70% of the time you you don't you leaving us anyway. So what's the point of of of, of keep pressing this relationship out when it doesn't seem like you you females even like us? You want to use us because that's what you've been taught 50 plus some odd years to use us to get what you need from us. But to be with us, it, 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 it seems like you women, it doesn't seem like it is. You women don't like us. And it's okay. But once again, don't get mad at Rashad because, you know, everybody else around Rashad wants to, uh, wants to deal with us. No, I, I don't. I don't. I don't hear Becky and Maria talking about niggas ain't shit. I've never. I. I don't hear that from other groups of women. Oh, uh, niggas ain't shit. I've never heard, heard Lou Long say niggas ain't shit. I've never heard this. You don't hear this from other women. Oh, niggas ain't shit. You just don't hear it. But gentlemen. I, I'm, you you can do what you listen, John. You can do whatever you want to do. At the end of the day, it's it's all up to you, fellas. I'm not I'm not going to sit and get mad. You gentlemen can try to work out this imaginary fake black love that they keep talking about. That really, that with the numbers show that don't exist. Because black love, let's be honest. I'm saying again, black love does not exist. This is what the numbers say. This is not what I'm saying. Black love does not exist according to the numbers. It doesn't exist. So I don't understand why you're getting crucified for going for 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 going elsewhere, for seeking uh, greener pastures elsewhere. Because where we at, it seems like it's bone dry. It's just dried up. It's like a desert over here, gentlemen. There's no there's there's no oasis. There is no happiness. There's no nothing. Just a bunch of people pumping it, uh, having sex, creating bastard children. And that's it. No building, just a bunch of skeet. Skeet, skeet, skeet. Like, uh, like John, John, uh, uh, little John used to say. Skeet, skeet. That's all a whole bunch of skeet, skeet, skeeting going on. But as far as black love, gentlemen, there is no black love going on. No black love going on, gentlemen. Let's, let's stop fooling ourselves, man. We only fooling ourselves. We're talking about some black love, man. Gentlemen, come on, man. Be real. But that's all I gotta say, gentlemen. Fifty percent, seventy percent, eighty-five percent we seek them, but seventy percent they divorce us, gentlemen. These women don't like you, bro. You getting used for whatever you can get used, um, getting your half, getting your resources taken, and while they taking your resources, they 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 still riding multiple penises. That's what's going on in the so-called community. But nobody wants to tell the truth. But uh, gentlemen, I'm gonna say it again, man. Numbers don't lie. Black love don't exist. This is like part two I did a couple months ago. But yeah, gentlemen, black love, according to the numbers, don't exist. It's, it's black pumping and dumping does. And that's that's basically it. But gentlemen, that's all I got to say, man. Gentlemen, you enjoy your day and uh, get yourself out the matrix, man. Get you, get you somebody that's going to uh, appreciate you and not use you up like a piece of... Uh, like a piece of uh, wet toilet, wet toilet paper. All right, peace.